welcome you. This is Reverend Robert Gatia, the senior pastor of the Reference Church in Kidani, Mombasa, Kenya. We are exactly at midnight. We are getting into the month of April, the, 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 the fourth month of the year 2020 the year of restoration and demonstration. The word of God is the same yesterday, today and forevermore. The name of the, Jesus is the same yesterday, today and forevermore. I am here tonight for, 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 for this cross, or crossover to a new man and I want to give men and women of God, people that have been waiting for this opportunity, I want you to know our God is a faithful God and he will never leave us he will never leave us alone. And he is doing something to take us to the place where we belong, to the glory of God. Listen to me and listen to me very well. The heart of God is upon our country. The heart of God is upon us. And tonight, I, I came so that we can pray together with you. We command the month of April and speak the favor of God tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. And I want, I want to of, of the new month of April to let you know that the heart of God is so faithful. The heart of God is able to help us and to keep us going in the name of Jesus Christ. I want us to read from the book of Isaiah 54 and verses 17. I read three verses, I read three scriptures and they will cross the world that will ever prosper. And every tongue that have accused us in judgment, that tongue we condemn. We condemn the voice of Corona virus. COVID-19, we condemn you in the name of Jesus Christ. And in the month of April, we deny you access to this month. And we stand at the gate of the month of April tonight to decree and declare that the power of the blood of Jesus is holding our, our, is holding our nation in the name of Jesus Christ. Satan, you are a loser. Mm. You cannot take over this country. We, we declare from this, this morning, yes. the, first, the very first hours of the, of the month of April mm. 2020, mm. I decree and declare yes. as an authority, yes. as a spiritual authority, yes. I decree to the power of darkness, mm. I decree to praise yes. sicknesses and diseases yes. that your time is over. Is over. And tonight, mm. we cancel your operation. We cancel we Psalms 91 yes. and verses 11. Yes. I'm reading these scriptures tonight yes. and then we get some time to pray yes. and, and release the power of God. Yes. We are standing at the gate of yes. the month of April oh, shakata, and we shakata. enter this month yes. with authority and power. Yes. We enter this month yes. with the faith and, and, and with the courage yes. knowing we have conquered coronavirus. Yes. We shall follow every directive from the ministry of health. Mm. We shall start according to the word of the Lord. Yes. And we start at the gate of the month of April mm. and we arrest the spirit, uh, the spirit behind coronavirus yes. and we command that spirit, you shall not prosper, yes. you shall scatter by fire, scatter. you shall be silenced once and for Silence. all, you will not scare of or, or you will not scare or terrify yes. this country and this continent. Yes. The world will, will not be ashamed, will not be afraid yes. of you. Yes. We shall silence you, coronavirus. Silence. Your time is over. over. We silence you by the authority of Christ. Fire. I am reading from the book of Psalms 91 mm. verses 11. Yes. The Bible says, For he shall give his angels charge over you yes. to keep you in all your ways. Yes. The Lord will give us angels mm. to charge over us yes. the month of April. Yes. We deploy heavenly angels yes. to guard our children, yes. to guard our borders, yes. to guard our hospitals, yes. to guard our officers, yes. to guard our leaders. Yes. The angels of God yes. from heaven yeah. we deploy you tonight deploy over you. the church that yes. is brought at the Christ yes. over every servant of God yes. and by the authority of Christ yes. we speak the blood of Jesus. Mm -hmm. Verses 12. Verses 12 say, For he shall, verses 12 say, In their heart they shall bear you up, lest you dash your foot against a stone. We shall not dash against a stone mm -hmm. in the name of the Lord. I study here tonight, mm -hmm. to, uh, this morning, early the, the very early hours of the morning of 
of, of April 2020 mm. to declare we are here to overcome and to silence the voice of coronavirus. Mm. You shall not be mentioned again. Yes. Your name will be erased in the in the history of the world. Yes. You shall become a thing of the past. Yes. You shall not be the breaking news of the continent of the world. Yes. We silence you in the night, in this night. Yes. And in the month of April, yes. we weaken your authority. Yes. We strip you your power. Yes. We strip you your ability. Yes. We strip you your your, your we strip you your, 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 your force. Yes. Yes. That force we deny you we it deny. in the name of in Jesus. Name of coronavirus, Jesus. we break your tentacles. We, break we destroy your tentacles. We, we command them to wither. wither. We silence them tonight. We, silence we them. command them to lose their grip. Yes. Yes. They shall not touch another Kenya. Amen. We are not losing another soul. Yes. This country is in the hearts of the Lord. Yes. And tonight, yeah. in the name of Jesus, Jesus we did. silence coronavirus we silence from the top of our head yes. to the top of our feet. Oh, we speak our soil yes. is safe from coronavirus. Yes. I speak tonight yes. as a servant of God yes. that our life yes. is in the hands of God. Yes. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. And I decree and declare yes. we are safe, we are in, safe. The in the hands of the Lord. Yes. I want to read the final scripture yes. and then I am I'm able to share the and, and then we are able to pray. Yes. And, in, and also invite Reverend Mitchell to share with us a scripture and pray. Yes. And the Lord will minister to us. In the book of Exodus, I'm talking about divine exemption. Yes. And I, I want to pray with this, with this um, uh, the book of Exodus 8, verses, 20, verses 22 and 23. Or we can read from verses 20. I want us to read this scripture. Let us read from verses 20. Mm -hmm. The book of Exodus chapter, uh, chapter 8, verses 20. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, and the Lord said to Moses, yes. rise early in the morning. Yes. We are early in the morning. Yes. This is the earliest morning hours yes. of, the, of the month of April. Yes. And start before Pharaoh. Yes. We are studying before coronavirus. Mm. We are studying before the demonic forces that are spreading this virus. Yes. COVID-19. Yes. I in the morning. Oh. We are coming again too. To and this night, yes. in the name of Jesus, Jesus name. we are studying before you. Hallelujah. God and the Lord said to Moses, yes. rise early in the morning. Rise. Start before Pharaoh. Yes. As he come out of the water, yes. out to the water. Yes. Then say to him, yeah. that says the Lord, yes. let my people go, yes. that they may serve me. Oh. I command mad coronavirus. Yes. You must let the people of God let go. Them go. You cannot hold them back to their houses. Yes. You cannot hold or you cannot hold professional men and women yes. home at their home. They cannot they cannot go to their offices. Yes. They cannot congregate anymore. Yes. I speak to the spirit behind coronavirus yes. in the name oh. of Jesus. Let the people of God go, go. and serve their God yes. and do their work yes. and report to their work yes. in the name of Jesus. Verses 21. Oh. What does the Bible say? Listen to the word of the Lord. Or else, if you will not let my people go, yes. behold, I will send the swarm of fries yes. on you yes. and your servant, yes. on your people, yes. and into your houses. Yes. The houses of Egyptians yes. shall be full of swarm of fries hey. and also the ground on which they stand. Oh. Verses 22. I love verses 22. Yes. The Bible says, And in that day yes. I will set apart yes. the land of Goshen in which my, my people dwell, dwell, that no swarm of fries shall be there, there in order that you may know that I am the Lord in the midst of the land. Hallelujah. Mm. Verses 23. This is where our message is. Yes. Wow. What does the Bible say? I will make a difference between my people and your people. Tomorrow, this sign shall be. Go to verses 24. Verses 24. And we are good to go. And the and Lord did so. so. That is enough. We don't mm -hmm. have to read the whole, the, the, the rest. I want you to know, and this is what the Bible says, uh, that, and I will see in that day, yeah. the land of Goshen, yes. in which my people dwell, yes. that no swarm yes. of fries yes. shall be there. Yes. To the end, they, thou mayest know yes. that I am the Lord. Yeah. 
and I will put a division. Yes. Another version, I will put a division yes. between my people yeah. and thy people. Yeah. Tomorrow shall this be the sign. Hey. In the midst of the prayer, yeah. there is a priest called Goshen. Hallelujah. In the midst of coronavirus, yes. listen to me, my friend. Yes. Listen to me, my brother, sisters and brothers. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, yes. wherever you may be, yes. across the face of the earth, yes. across the face of the earth, yes. whether you are in America, yes. whether you are in China, yes. whether you are in Europe, yes. whether you are in Africa, yes. whether you are in Asia, yes. wherever you are, mm. I want you to know yes. in the midst of this of this virus, yes. there is a place called Goshen. Yes. The Bible is clear mm. that God has a Goshen. Yes. In Egypt, mm. this question is not in Canaan. Mm. It is in Egypt. Mm. It is in the middle of the problem yes. where God has secured a place yes. to safeguard His people. Yes. Even if this coronavirus has attacked the whole world, yes. there is a Goshen yeah. for the righteous people. Yeah. God has prepared a Goshen, yes. and that is where He is calling His people. Yes. And this month of April yes. is our Goshen. Yes. This month of April, yes. it is when we shall see the decline yes. of the spread of coronavirus yes. because God has set a Goshen mm. for the people or for His people. Yes. In the midst of this virus, mm. I want you to know mm. where the plague we will never come. Mm. We that in this Goshen, mm. we are un, at Goshen, mm. we are untouchable. Mm. Listen to me and listen to me very well. Mm. Goshen is a place where God has set apart. Goshen is a stable of the sacred place of the most high God. Yeah. It's where God is reigning with his people. That is why we are worshiping with you tonight. We are creating our an atmosphere of a Goshen mm. in the land of Kenya, in our borders. Mm. In our cities, in our villages, in our home, we are decreeing there is a Goshen. And in that Goshen, we shall be saved to the glory of God. There will be a divine exemption. We shall be exempted from this plague. Listen to me and listen to me good. Anyone listening to me tonight, the month of April is our month of divine exemption. Mm. We shall be exempted from the attack of the demons, mm. the attacks of sorcerers and wishes, mm. the attacks of wickedness of the world, mm. and we shall be exempted from this viral attack of COVID-19. Mm. COVID-19, you have no authority mm. over our children, over our families, over our city and our nation. And we speak the protection that is divine. And tonight, as we get into the month, as we as we begin a new month, it is a month of good news. We shall not receive bad news. We declare all the statistics that have been said, yeah. all the information that people have received. Yeah. We declare a different report yes. from tonight in the name of the Lord. By covenant, while the world is going through depression and deterioration in everything, by covenant, we are going to experience divine exemption. Our success is in the heart of the living God. It is our, it is our, it is our portion. Our exemption is our portion. Exemption is your portion. Wherever you are, I want you to know tonight we are being exempted from, uh, from every prayer, from every disaster in the name of Jesus Christ. I want to bless you. And to let you know, we are in the month of April. This is not the month of March. The month of April mm. is a month of success and is not a month of failure. Mm. It is a month of exemption. It is not a month. It is not a month of attack. Mm. It is a month of victory. Mm. It is not a month of failure Amen. because the Lord has exempted us. Exempted. Divine exemption yes. is our portion. Yes. We shall not be exempted by the heart of a man. Yes. We shall be exempted by a supernatural enablement. Amen. Amen. There is a supernatural hand mm. stretched upon our life yeah. by Jehovah God Jehovah. to exempt us from this attack Jehovah. in the name of Jesus Christ. Of Jesus. And we speak to the air, or the air over this country, mm. the air over Kenya, to reject coronavirus. Mm. We speak speak to the water of this country yes. to reject coronavirus. Reject we speak to the blood of this country yes. to reject coronavirus reject in the name of Jesus in Christ. Of Jesus. And tonight, tonight, I release the power yes. 
that saves the lamb in the name of Jesus Christ. I break every force yes. of coronavirus. Yes. I strip the power and the force behind coronavirus. Yes. I break it and strip its authority yes. in the name of Jesus. And by the authority of Christ, I declare a miracle. Yes. The month of April is our month of divine exemption. And there is a mark that God has given us to overcome this, uh, this uh, to have to experience this exemption. We are blessed from the top of our head to the toe of our feet. Father, by the authority you have given me, I release a grace of exemption. I decree that in the month of April, I stand at the gate of this month and I deny Yes. Every I deny any access mm. of the of the COVID nineteen yes. coronavirus yes. against this country. Yes. I I denied access to our land. Yes. I denied access to our people, yes. to our institution, yes. to our villages, yes. and to our cities. Yes. And in the name of Jesus, name of I Jesus. cover the gates of Kenya yes. with the blood of Jesus. Yes. I cover our people. Yes our children, yes. our neighborhood, yes. I speak the protection of Jehovah. Yes. I command coronavirus yes. to lose your power lose your and power. to lose your grip. Yes. And in the name of Jesus, name of Jesus. I release this country Whoa. from the burden and the bondage yes. of this demonic sickness. Yes. And I declare that we are free from demonic harassment. Yes. And the month of April is our month of divine exemption. Mm -hmm. I speak exemption speak. in the name of Jesus. Yes. I bless Kenya from the north yes. to the south. Yes. I bless Kenya from the east to the west. Yes. And in the name of Jesus, yes. I declare blessing ah. from the top of our head yes. to the toe of our feet. Yes. Our land is blessed. Yes. Our people are blessed. Yes. Our water is are blessed. Yes. Our, la our air is blessed. Yes. And in the name of Jesus, yes. I declare victory oh. against coronavirus. Yes. May the hand of God yes. be our portion. Yes. Kenya shall be exempted. Yes. Africa shall be exempted. Yes. The globe shall be exempted. Yes. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, so shall it be. Yes. That is what God shall do. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Yes. I want to take this opportunity to uh, welcome you to the month of April. Yes. Welcome to this month. Yes. Welcome and, and square up your shoulder and tell the devil, yeah. in the month of April, yes. I am exempted. Mm -hmm. And the protection and divine exemption is my portion. Mm -hmm. I am not a candidate of failure. I am not a candidate of shame. I have what God has said I have. Mm. I am exempted. Mm. I have been, I, God has put a division. No prayer shall, shall come near my dwelling place. In the name of Jesus. I want to come the Richard to say a word and pray with us and then we shall wind up together to the glory of God. What a blessing to have you in the month of April. Imagine the devil has not killed you in the month of March. You are going to live in the month of April. You shall see this year coming to an end and you shall live all your days and experience the grace and the labor of God. Help me welcome this woman of God under the anointing of the Holy Spirit that she can share a word and then we pray together. And we shall, we shall call it a time and a day that God has given us. Welcome, Reverend Rachel, uh, in this uh, live cast. Bless the people of God. Hallelujah. It is an honor to have you around. Amen. You are welcome. Thank you. Hallelujah. This is our month of divine exemption. We are standing at the gate. Reverend Gatia has stood at the gate and declared, April will not be like March. We are in a different month. We are guarding our gates. We are possessing the gates of April in the mighty name of Jesus. No matter what happened in March, no matter what came through our gates in March, we are possessing the gates of April by fire and by force in the mighty name of Jesus. The Bible says in Matthew 16, 18, the gates of hell shall not prevail. Jesus said, I will build my church. He said, I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail. We are declaring today in the mighty name of Jesus, the gates of hell shall not prevail against your family, against your children, against your security. 
In the mighty name of Jesus, wherever coronavirus is from, it is with the gates of hell. And we are declaring today, it shall not prevail. Wherever you are at home, wherever you are listening to me, declare today, the gates of hell shall not prevail against my door, shall not prevail against my children, shall not be, be prevail against my finances. In the mighty name of Jesus, we are refusing the gates of hell today. We are standing at the gate of March and April, and we are saying, this April, the gates of hell, they shall not prevail in the mighty name of Jesus. In Revelation 12 and verse 7 to 8, listen to this very carefully. In verse 7, he says, And there was a war in heaven. Michael and his angels fought up against the dragon. And the dragon fought with his angels. Verse 8 is the, is the verse. The first line says what? 12 8 says what? And the dragon lost the battle. In this, in, in KJB, it says, And he prevailed not, as I was telling you. April 2020, the gates of hell shall not prevail. Satan did not prevail against the angels. He will not prevail in this battle. In the mighty name of Jesus, the Bible says KJB, Revelation 12, verse 8, And they prevail not. Hallelujah. Amen. Let us stand at the gates. Let us stand at the gates. Mm -hmm. You are right now in the gate of your family. We have been removed from the land that we have been living, existing, doing what we are doing. We are coming back to possess the gates. We are coming back to possess our gates. In the mighty name of Jesus, we have been attacked. Our gates have been invaded by coronavirus. We want to unite as believers and attack the gates of hell, the gates of coronavirus in the mighty name of Jesus. Can you say after me, my father, my father, my father and my God, as I pray this April month, any womb that has conceived evil on us, on us, on our loved ones, right now, in the mighty name of Jesus, may it be scattered. In my mighty name of Jesus, let it backfire. Let it backfire. Let it backfire. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let us go. I ask you to pray for me while you're at home. Let us go together. Let us pray together in these 10 minutes. Wherever you are, make that your altar. Make that your church. Make that your sanctuary. Become the pastor in your house. Begin to declare from today. You're coming out of that house. We are going back to work. We are going back to school. We are taking back our authority. In this month of April, we are not going to be pushed out of our, our places. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, we are getting back our finances. We are getting back our jobs. We are getting back our families. We are getting back our children. This month of April, the gates of hell will not prevail. In the mighty name of Jesus, we are possessing the gates. I say we are possessing the gates. We are possessing the gates. In the mighty name of Jesus, we have been attacked. Yes. But we are standing right there yes. and declaring that the gates of hell, the gates of corona, they shall not prevail yes. in the mighty name of Jesus. Let us read from Isaiah chapter 7, verse 5 to 7. Mm -hmm. Let's go 1, 2, 3. Isaiah chapter 7 and verse 5 to 7. It says this, KJV, because Syria, Ephraim, and the son of Remaliah, have taken evil counsel against this saying. Hallelujah. Ephraim is Israel. Hallelujah. Let's continue. Let us go up against Judah and vex it. And let us make a bridge bearing for us and set a king in the midst of it. Even the son of Tabor. Let's go to the next verse. One, two, three, verse seven. Thus says the Lord. One again, one more time. Thus says the Lord. Again, thus say the Lord God. Again, thus say the Lord What does the Lord God say? It shall not stand, neither shall it come to pass. We are declaring in the name of Jesus, coronavirus, you will not stand. I said you will not stand. You will not come to pass. You are not going to continue to exist in our borders. We are sending you out from the gate of April. We are standing at the gate of April. And we are declaring, coronavirus, you will not stand. In the name of Jesus, whatever you have programmed, whatever wickedness has programmed into this year 2020, we are standing at the gate of April and we are declaring, you shall not stand. You shall not stand. You shall not pass. No matter how far it has gone, no matter what has happened, we are declaring, those who are alive, 
they shall stay alive. Yes. Those who have been infected, they shall be healed. Those who are not infected, they shall not be infected. We are standing at the gate. Yes. We are closing the gate. Yes. We are refusing access. In the mighty name of Jesus, we are getting into the gate. We are getting into the spiritual realm. We are standing at the gate. We realize we were attacked. We realize that our gate was broken into. We realize you got access where you are not to have access. But this night, 2020, April number one, we are at our gates. I said we are at our gates. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let me tell you what gates are. Gates are where spirits meet. Gates are where spirits meet. Gates are where destinies of individuals, mm -hmm. communities, mm -hmm. and nations are determined. Mm -hmm. The gate is the meeting place mm -hmm. between divinity and humanity. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Jacob saw the gate of heaven. He, Jacob was a human being, and he met divinity mm -hmm. at the rock in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The gate is a meeting place for judges. Mm -hmm. It's a meeting place for those who have influence over cities. Amen. Hallelujah. We want to deal with those gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. We want to deal with those spirits sitting at the gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. In the book of Daniel, there was a spirit at the gate mm -hmm. dictating what was happening in the slavery of the children of Israel. Mm -hmm. We are going to deal with that spirit today in the mighty name of Jesus. We are going to break through today in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. There are gates. There is a gate of heaven. There is a gate of hell. There is a gate of Jerusalem. There is a gate of politics. There is a gate of influence. There is a gate of divine intervention. There is a gate of financial intervention. There are spiritual gates. And today we are going to where they are controlled. Whoever is controlling the gate of coronavirus, can you say after me at home, whoever you are, controlling the gate of coronavirus, we are the word of the Lord. We are the word of the Lord. Right now, by fire, your time is over. By fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, die, 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 die. 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 That spirit for one day. That spirit of spirit controlling the gate from coronavirus. Wherever you are, as we are standing, members of the church are speaking now. Members of the church of Christ, everybody listening to me, whoever is speaking at that gate, commanding coronavirus, we are the one of the Lord. Right now, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire. We are dealing with you right now. We are standing at the gate. We are coming back to our position. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Kenya, Mombasa is a gate. Our court is a gate. You have to be clear at that gate. You have to get paid taxes to cross that gate. The airport is the gate. Even families have a gate. Hallelujah. Even your family has a gate. Hallelujah. And we want to deal with the gate that opened up that door. For coronavirus in the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. The gate that opened up that door mm -hmm. for diseases in the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. Whoever was working together, mm -hmm. whichever human being, work together with that spirit mm -hmm. to make coronavirus take control. Yeah. 2020 March, we are closing that gate. I said we are closing that gate wow. in the mighty name of Jesus. Yeah. Those who keep these gates are very strategic people. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yeah. Let us deal with those gatekeepers. Mm -hmm. There are human beings that have been assigned to be gatekeepers, to open wickedness, to open evil, to open calamity into the world. But this 2020, unlike any other year, we have been hit very hard by this coronavirus. We have been locked down as the app. We have been locked down as the globe. We want to deal with that gatekeeper wherever he is in the mighty name of Jesus. Whichever king or queen is standing on this world connected with the gatekeeper from hell that opened coronavirus wherever you are right now we are sending the fire of the holy spirit to you hallelujah i want you to say after me every wicked gatekeeper every wicked gatekeeper every wicked gatekeeper every wicked gatekeeper hear the word of the lord hear the word of the lord right now right now wherever you are wherever you are by fire by fire by fire Coronavirus. Yes, keep, yes, keep Die by fire. 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 Die by
want to go to that gate mm -hmm. and contend with that gate, mm -hmm. it must open in the mighty of, name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. We must take possession of that gate in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. We must take possession of those commodities in the mighty name of Jesus. We are going to that gate. I say we are going to that gate mm -hmm. because Elijah said, at that gate is where the prices are determined. And today, more than ever before, mm -hmm. the prices of commodities in Kenya and around the world are being redetermined. Mm -hmm. Saints of God, we must stand up at this gate mm -hmm. in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. Pray after me and say, My Father, my Father, my Father, my, father, my, father, and my God, my father, as, father, I pray, as I pray, this midnight, this, midnight, this morning, this morning, first of April, first of April every gate. Every gate, every gate, every gate, determining, determining the, prices the prices of commodity. Of commodity. Hear the word of the Lord. Hear the word, Hear the of, word of the Lord. The right, word of the Lord. Now. Right, now. right now, right now, right now. You evil gate people, you die, by die, by die by fire. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus, Elisha was a prophet. He stood at that gate. And he declared, my people have been suffering. My people have not been eating. My people have not been sleeping. And right now, in the name of Jesus, I am bringing down that gate. In the mighty name of Jesus, let's say I declare, I and I decree, and I, I take possession I take of possession the gate of valley. I take possession I take of possession the gate of, the gate of, far. of far. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of who? Jesus Christ. The last scripture was three. Let's go to verse three. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Those people who do not have food, I take the line of Elisha. I declare and decree. In the next 24 hours, you shall get food. I open up the door for you. I open up the opportunities for you. This April 2020, I stand at the gate. I bring down the gatekeeper that has been holding the food. I bring down the gatekeeper that has been making you hungry. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let us go to verse 3. Let's go to verse 3 in the name of Jesus. Let's go 1, 2, 3. And they were I hope you're reading with me at home, saints of God. And they were at the entrance of the gate. Where? At the entrance of the gate. Where? At the entrance of the gate. Where? At the entrance of the gate. Saints of God. It's about the gates. It's about the gates. It's about the gates. It's about the gates. We are possessing the gates. It's about the gates. They came to the gates. The gates of hell. They took the gates of food. They have taken the gates. Hallelujah. Who controlled the gates? The four lepers mm -hmm. who have been controlling our kids. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Saints of God, mm -hmm. it is the four lepers mm -hmm. that saved Samaria. Mm -hmm. It was not the king, mm -hmm. it was not the military, mm -hmm. it was not the army, mm -hmm. it was not the police force, mm -hmm. it was not the NYS, mm -hmm. it was the four lepers, mm -hmm. and they were at the gate. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. We want to change our God. We want to change our God. Mm -hmm. We want to change our, our God. Mm -hmm. We want to change our God. Yeah. We want to change our God. Amen. I want to change the God in your home. Yes. Somebody else is at the gate. Yeah. Our gates will not be manned by lepers. Mm. Our gates will not be manned by the blind. Yeah. Our gates will not be manned by the dead. Mm -hmm. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. our gates are being manned by the wicked. Mm -hmm. Our gates will not be manned by diseases. Yeah. Coronavirus you will not man our gates. Yeah. In the mighty name of Jesus, yeah. we say that say the gates of right shall not prevail. Amen. They were being manned by lepers. Yeah. Right now in the world, mm -hmm. we are the last to know about coronavirus. Mm -hmm. Our governments are the last to know. Mm -hmm. Our kings are the last to know. Mm -hmm. Saints of God and pastors and bishops are the last to know. But the gatekeepers knew. Mm -hmm. Gatekeepers know more mm -hmm. than even the kings. Mm -hmm. 
Hallelujah. Amen. As we are seated in this room, this church we have, I want us to pray in tongues. One minute before we finish this particular prayer point about the gates, because people's gates have been attacked. Amen. Saints of God in this room, let us pray in tongues. Let us pray in tongues for the people who are listening to us at home. As I begin to tell them, the gates include the gates of your eyes, the gates of your ears, the gates of your brain, the gates of your health, the gates of your finances, the gates of your jobs. Our gates have been attacked. Other gatekeepers have taken over the gates. And we want to take over those gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Our gates have been attacked. Our gates have been taken over. We are being held hostage. Somebody else at our gates. We want to come down and bring down those gates. We want to bring down that demonic power standing at the gates. In the mighty name of Jesus, if you are at home, begin to pray. Begin to think of the gates that have been attacked in the name of Jesus. Think of the gates of your home. Think of the gates of your home. Think of the gates of your jobs. Think of the gates of your businesses. Think of the gates of your bodies. Think of the gates of your eyes. Think of them in the mighty name of Jesus. We want to come against that demonic power. Standing at that gate. We want to change God. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus. Let us begin to mention the gates. Mention your own gates. The gates of the Dantias. The gates of the Church speaking them. The gates of the Church of Christ. Begin to mention the gates. Begin to mention the gates. The gates of education. Begin to mention them. The gates of hell. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ora Mayerete. Ora Baba Yereta. O Karama Yereta. O Karama Yereta. Shirina Kili Mayereta. Ikarama. Let's go, my father, my father. My father, my God. As I pray this midnight, every wicked demon, every wicked demonic power sitting at my gate, sitting at my family gate, my financial gate, my employment gate, my provision gate, hear the word of the Lord. Speak about your gates right now by fire. Speak to that gate. Pull down those gates. Pull down those gates. Mention that gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Mention them. We are changing God. We are changing God. In the next year, we are changing God. This is me, the Nashi. Okara Mayerete. Okara Ma. Yesharana. Ora Tete. The gates of prayer. The gates of intercession. The gates of evangelism. We are bringing down every bit of demonic power assigned to those gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Okara Ma. We are going to be the sons released to the gates. We are the sons that have been released to go and stand at the gates. We shall contend on behalf of our fathers. We shall contend on behalf of our generation. We shall contend on behalf of our children. You shall be our contender. Whoever is alive, 2020 April, hearing my voice, you shall be our son at the gate. Fighting on behalf of our nation, fighting on behalf of our children, fighting on behalf of our fathers, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, yeri ma yere ta, o kara ma yere ta, o kaka shiri ba yere deri ma ba yere te kara ma, o ra ma yere te keri ma. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare a decree according to Obadiah 117. It says, But upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance. Oh, yes. May the Spirit of God penetrate your homes. May the Spirit of God reach you where you are. May the Spirit of God empower you where you are. May you become an intercessor. May you stand at your gates. May you overcome. May you stand up straight. May you fight your enemies. May you stand at the gates. Take over for your children. Take over for your fathers. Take over for this generation in the mighty name of Jesus. The same way coronavirus came in, coronavirus shall come out in the mighty name of Jesus. We are taking our position, saints of God, believers of God. We are taking our positions. 
We are taking our positions in the mighty name of Jesus. Obadiah 117 says, But upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance. I declare and decree you shall de be delivered. I command your deliverance. I command the deliverance of your family, of your husband and your wife, of your children. I command deliverance of your investments, of the work of your hands, of your finances. In the mighty name of Jesus, may you receive deliverance. May you receive deliverance. In the mighty name of Jesus, I declare holiness upon you. You will not be bitter. You will not hold unforgiveness. In this time of intervention, in this time of being a gatekeeper, in the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. And the last line says, and the house. Let's read together. And the house of Jacob shall possess their possessions. God bless you. Amen. Wow, 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 wow. Blessed be the name of the Lord. What an opportunity to share the word of the Lord and, 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 speak, and speak a new revelation in the month of April. We are already in the month of April, the month of divine exemption, and the heart of God is our portion. We start here to know that at the gate we are secure. And I want to wind up by saying the Lord is our stronghold. The Lord is our hope. And a strong tower, the name of the Lord is a strong tower where the righteous run and they are saved. I finally wind up by reading the book of Psalms 127 because this is where we, we have finished when we talk about the gate. We are secure at the gate. Psalms 127, verses 1 to verses 5. The Bible says, Unless the Lord build the house, the, the, they labor in vain who build it. Unless the Lord guard the city, the watchman stays awake in vain. Verses 2 says, verses 2 says, in, it is in vain for you to rise up early and to sit up late, to eat the bread of soul, for so gives his beloved sleep. Verses 3, I, I want to go to verses 3. Behold, children are inherited from the Lord. The fruit of the womb is a reward. Verses 4. That is my verse, verses 4 and 5. Like, like arrows in the heart of a warrior, so, so are the children of one's youth. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Number Amen. five. Number, number five. five. That is where that we is are last verse. That is where we are winding up on. Yes, in the name of the Lord, it yeah. is said, Happy is the man who has his quiver full of them. They shall not be ashamed but shall speak with their enemy in the gate. We start at the gate of the month of April and we speak to every force of darkness, any witch, any sorcerer, any wicked authority, powers and dominions of men, or rulers of darkness and forces of evil. We speak to you in the name of the Lord and we declare today by the anointing of the Holy Ghost, we break your authority. By the anointing of Christ, yeah. we declare that at the gate you are broken. Yeah. Coronavirus, you cannot pass this, you yes. cannot get past this gate. Yeah. And with a hedge of the blood yeah. of Jesus Christ, we command you to lose your dirty head yeah. out of our life, out of our country. Yes. You have no authority over this country. You have no authority over the globe. Yeah. Men and women listening to us across the world, yeah. wherever you are, I want to declare tonight yeah. is a night of, an, of a divine exemption. Yeah. You shall be exempted of the demonic activities against your life. You are blessed from the top of your head yeah. to the toe of your feet. Yeah. You are rising up and you are coming back yeah. is blessed of the Lord. I decree that the month of April, it is a month of victory. It is a month of testimony. It is a month of sign and waters. We shall speak the goodness of the Lord. I decree it is done. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, so shall it be. I want you to know that the Lord has given us a brand new month. We cannot struggle again. I want, us to, I want to speak the authority of the word of the Lord. Over whatever you touch to do, we are in the best month ever. The devil is a loser. We are not going down. We are rising up with energy and passion to see God moving in our life. I want to speak to us in the name of the Lord. 
We want to come to the cross of the service. And I want to bless you. I want to speak a blessing, benediction, and, and, and allow you to get into the month of, the, of the month of April with the covenant blessing. We are going to bless the Lord those that, that I know you believe in the I, I know you believe in the in the principle and the doctrine of giving and receiving. You understand what the Bible says about how in our heart we should prepare to serve the Lord. We have our we have our we want to bless the Lord with our we want to bless the Lord with our giving. We want to bless the Lord with our uh, with our offering and we want to to believe God for our life. In our church, deliverance church Mikidani, every beginning of the month we have an altar offering. We always go to the altar and give a sacrifice for the sake of committing a new season because God has divided time and season in different ways. And in every time you enter in a season, a new month, a new year, a new decade. And I told people 2020 is a new year and it is a new decade. We are celebrating two, two kind of a celebration. And the third celebration is that Deliverance Church International, we are celebrating 50 years of existence in this country and in the world. And I want you to, I want you to become a beneficiary of this blessing by committing and trusting God to become a blessing to the work that we are doing. We have so many activities we are doing to the community and to the people in our society. And we have seen the Lord move us forward. I speak to you in the name of the Lord that the month of April is your month of divine exemption. You shall be exempted from hunger. You shall be exempted from sickness and diseases. You shall be exempted from being sacked from the job. You shall be exempted from failure and desperation. You have been exempted. And the Lord shall distinguish you with every other person because you have been exempted. You are earmarked for exemption. 2020, the month of April, the month of exemption, the Lord will favor you in Jesus' name. We are on the on your screen. There are our pay bill number. There is our our PayPal number. You can you can bless the Lord. And in giving, it is from the heart. We are cheerful givers. We love when we serve the Lord with our resources. And the Lord will minister to us. And I also want to pray for you who want to get saved in a new month and say, This time I want to give my life to Christ. Can I pray for you? Father, say after me, Father. I come to you. I recognize I am a sinner. Forgive me my sin. Write my name in the book of life. For, and, and cleanse me by your precious blood. And from today, erase my name from the book of death. And let me become your child. And by your Holy Spirit, uphold me to live for Christ. This being my prayer and confession. In Jesus' name, so shall it be. God, Father, I bless you because of the souls that have accepted this prayer and confessed this by faith. I decree them born again and I cover them with the blood of Jesus and pray for protection. And Lord, I know you shall uphold them with the truth of your word. And by your Holy Spirit, they shall grow in faith in Jesus' name. As you have prayed that prayer, I want you to hit our inbox, tell us your name and give us your contact we can help you to grow and connect you to a church near where you are whether in africa in the us in europe in asia wherever you are we can be able to we can be able to disciple you and grow you in the things of god through the through the scripture and through the prayer that we are going to pray together with you i want you to know this is deliverance church Mikidani, the church of choice we are in mombasa kenya and we are we, we believe in teaching and preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ. And if you are there and you have not yet liked our page, we, you can like Deliverance Church Mikidani. You can like Pastor Robert Gatia from the F F Facebook and you will be blessed. Welcome and God bless you. Thank you for having time together with us, even this midnight as we have come to a new man. In Jesus' name, so shall it be. God bless you. We love you so very much and you are important and you matter to God. Amen and Amen.